on this week's episode of Two Minute Roundup, a recap of the World Youth Rhino Summit, a bit of endangered species news, narwhal testicles, and what's the deal with that shark attack fake out? Find out now on your weekly blast of wildlife news. The first ever World Youth Rhino Summit was a huge success. 140 students met with conservation superstars like Dr. Ian Player and Paula Kahumbu. They even got to see an anti-poaching demo from the rangers. Here's another first. Everyone's wondering what's going on with Elisa Sursara's fake shark attack. The activist maintains she was bitten, but says the fake photo is not of her. Scientists agree this is a seriously fishy situation. In more shark news, a sea lion's escape was foiled when it got stuck in a shark cage. Catch the full video on earthtouchnews.com. From sea lions to Seal Beach, California, where a controversial coyote call has many people worried. The catch and kill plan comes after several pets were snatched in the area, pets that experts feel should be better managed. Still in California, where conservationists are working hard to land San Bernardino flying squirrels on the endangered species list. Until now, these rare mountain squirrels have been flying under the radar. Sticking with endangered species, a U.S. district judge ruled to reinstate Wyoming's gray wolves with endangered species status. The ruling restores much-needed protections to wolves throughout the state. From land to sea and this week's weirdest, narwhals with longer tusks have bigger testicles. New evidence shows sea unicorn tusks are the whale version of peacock feathers. They're there to tell the nar ladies, I'm a reproduction win. Narwhals are one of many animals affected by the changing Arctic climate. Actor Leonardo DiCaprio delivered a chilling speech at the UN Climate Change Summit in New York this week. We're wrapping up with a bit of good weather. An unusually warm day in the UK meant this tiny elephant could be born outside in a natural environment. A first for ZSL Whipsnade Zoo. That's it for this week, but don't forget you can read all about these stories by clicking the links in the video description. See you on Twitter, until next time.